So today I'm going to go into detail about the jobs that international students can do when they finally come to Germany. I know this is a topic that international students think about, about okay, when I come, how am I going to sustain myself? Especially if you are here with a sponsorship letter or you're looking for how to um, renew your visa or you're thinking ahead and you're saying, okay, how am I going to renew my visa in the coming year? So I'm going to list a couple of jobs that students can do in Germany. Uh, as an international student. The first job I'm going to recommend people to actually opt for would be the working students positions that you can find on any company website. So there are a lot of companies that offer opportunities for students to assist them and you gain experience this way. And this type of job can also give you the opportunity to work in that same company upon graduation. Most working student positions have a fixed contract of two years. So after the second year, you might not be able to work in that company again, or you might not be able to work in that same position again. Then you might apply for another working student position in another department. Right. So that is how the working student position works. Um, you gain experience with this and you can also use that to apply for jobs upon graduation as well. Be sure to check on company websites. There are a lot of um, job um, websites in Germany as indeed. You can use LinkedIn. There is um, Stepstone. There is Monster. There are a lot that you can check from. So be sure to check them out and look for a working student position that best suits your career interests. The second one is a student assistant. A student assistant position means that you're going to be assisting the professor at the university, maybe with carrying out research, or you could also be helping bachelor students with certain topics or assisting the professor in teaching bachelor students certain topics, um, like tutorial topics at the university. Now, um, this first two roles that I have just mentioned would be beneficial for you. There are things that you can write on your resume or your CV, whichever way you call it, and that would help you with your interviews when you actually start looking for a job when you graduate. Other jobs that you can do are menial jobs. There are a couple of them. You can work in a restaurant. For example, you can work in the kitchen. And if you speak German friendly, you might be um, recruited as a, wait a waiter or a waitress. So that way you're attending to customers who come there, taking their orders and making sure everything runs smoothly. If not, you can work in the kitchen where you're maybe washing dishes or chopping um, veggie tables. <laughs> veggie tables, I was going to say veggies. That you chop veggies or vegetables in the kitchen to assist with the cooking and all of that. So that is something else that you can do. Another um, job that is also available is um, sorting jobs or working in um, packaging factories. This is where you are kind of like packaging um, orders that people have made and then putting them in boxes or arranging them in trucks and stuff like that. For these kind of jobs, you have to be strong. Another kind of job that students do is um, cleaning. So students also clean offices, they clean apartments. You can register with a, um, a cleaning company or there are also apps that you can use. There's one called Helpling that you can use to like um, connect with clients and then you, you clean with them. You can earn between 9 euros and 15 euros on this kind of um, job, on the cleaning job that is. So... <laughs> if that is something that you um, want to do, be sure to check it out. For cleaning jobs, I think it gives you the opportunity to be much more flexible with your time. So then you, you choose a time that you can work and that way you can kind of know, okay, this time I'm studying, this time I'm working, and then you kind of create a schedule for yourself. So that's um, another alternative. Another alternative is working with a company that, that sells products. So I have done this before. Um, you can work in a clothing company. So a place like maybe um, H&M, Primark, um, Colosseum, C&A. There are a lot of shops available that sell products like clothes, that sell shoes, 
so you just go to, to their website check if they have any um, opportunity available it will be beneficial if you can speak at least um, conversational German because then you can answer clients questions or um, explain um, why a product is good or not so it's kind of like marketing so it's something that you can also write on your cv to be honest if you want to go into marketing or you want to go into sales so it's called fecalforin <laughs> um, i think i english i i pronounce it in english way so it's called a fecalfa or a fecalforin so if i if so it's a fecalfa position where you're kind of like selling products you add a till you process payments and all of that stuff so that is also something that students can do um, most times this role pays the minimum wage so that's like nine euros and a couple of cents <laughs> nine euros and a couple of cents per hour and for most of these roles you might not be able to choose your hours because then they are the ones dictating the times that you can work so this is why um, i prefer students to work to do a working student's position because then you are the one choosing the time you can work because they know you are a student and are much more flexible with the times. Yeah, a lot of food delivery companies that offer jobs to students with bicycles. So you use a bicycle to deliver like products to um, somebody who has ordered, for example, groceries or somebody who has ordered maybe a, a meal, maybe pizza or something from a particular shop so you ride a bicycle and then you go and deliver this product they offer between 12 euro to 15 euros per hour some of them offer per delivery but again i don't know much about that because i actually do not know anyone in particular who does this i've actually i've only seen the advertisement right so those are the kind of jobs that you can do as an international student in germany so this is just to um, put it out there. So if you're considering coming to Germany, you're not scared of coming to Germany There are jobs available that you can do. It's just for you to choose what kind of job that you want to do and then Go with it. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up that helps with visibility You can also comment um, in the comment section below if you have any questions please let me know and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as i can till my next video take good care of yourselves bye